18 years ago this week, on January 22nd, 1996, the night after the Royal Rumble on Monday Night Raw, Vader made his singles debut in the WWF, beating up, uh, or beating, I should say, Savio Vega. He beat up Vega some more after the match was over until referees and WWF president Gorilla Monsoon came out to stop him. Monsoon ended up suspending Vader indefinitely for his actions, to which Vader responded by assaulting Monsoon while Vince McMahon freaked out on commentary. The the reason they did this and suspended Vader right after his debut, because he had just showed up for the first time at the Rumble the night before, uh, was because he needed some time off for shoulder surgery. And it, it was a great angle. The Vader... The Vader-Jim Cornette dynamic very much reminds me of the Brock Lesnar-Paul Heyman dynamic today in that, in this angle, Vader was the unstoppable monster and not even his own manager could control him. Cornette did everything he could to hold Vader back because he knew, he knew that Vader had evil intentions for Gorilla Monsoon and he held Vader in the corner as long as he could until Vader could take no more and he shoved Cornette aside and he attacked him anyway. How many times have we seen Brock go nuts on TV and Paul Heyman has to step in and calm him down just to prevent things from going too far? Many, many times. And it works. It just works. 